not a single one without an electricity. In the most remote areas. What is it that individual families of farmers are doing which we can't do as a government? Because these ones are just one family. We are a government. How can we be outsmarted by one family which brings itself water, flushing toilet, electricity? Why can't we get the most basic rights? What have we done to who? Are we a cursed nation? Are we a defeated nation? Have we wronged someone somewhere so that we can... U.S. military take over. Yes. Do you think Nigeria is ready for it and do you think it's the best? Right? Okay, well, um, for me, really, I don't think it is, best. it is the best because every nation is moving towards democracy or making democracy better, okay? And the military comes or intervenes wherever there doesn't seem to be the right system of government being exercised all right why would uh, the gabon president make it a family thing i'm sorry i have to because i i try to like what is happening you know when you know i'm a country i'm too busy so when politicians start having problems i like oh what's what is their problem then i start to, like why the father ruled for 58 years handed over to the son so it's now become a family like uh, a room and pile of family you know, flat so if, if the military now felt, okay, they should take it up from him, okay, well. But for me, in, in, in Nigeria, I think Nigeria is too, we are too advanced or we are too mature to start doing military. As it is happening in the Francophone nations, what do you think, how do you react to this? Do you think military should or military can take over Nigeria? Um, actually, I'm a product of the military. And I've experienced military government in Nigeria so far. And I really believe much more in the military approach to addressing the problems we are facing today. So if uh, the military can take over, I don't have a problem with that. Because from indications of what is happening all over, all over Africa now, we can't rule that out completely. But if, above all, let the will of Allah be done. Um, backward thinking. That's backward. Whoever is thinking of me taking over at this age, such person is mischievous. And we should question the intention of such persons. You know, when you're talking about development of society, you know, it begins with human development. And human development starts from freedom. Freedom gives you, you know, empowerment. And from there, you, you liberate, you have fear fear. So, and the best thing that can give any society freedom is democracy system of governors so if anyone is not saying that uh, we should go back to military rule then that means that we are going back to where we have left uh, decades ago that's backward thinking and such thinking should not even be entertained the uh, uh, administration of uh, Eradua to Jonathan and Buhari you know there has been a lot of you know uh, insensitivities to the ap uh, appointment of service chief during Jonathan, you see whereby even all the service chiefs come from almost the same sector of the uh, nation. Same thing happened during the uh, Buari time. In fact, for, it's, it's even worse. For like eight years, we have service chiefs that come from a less single sector of the economy, and this contributes to the insecurity in our nations. Currently, I think the present administration tried a little. At least we have a spread of service chiefs in theories, you know, sector of the nation. So I think that is a right uh, that move in the right direction. It may not be perfect, but he has done credibly better than what we have been having over decades ago. So it, it's a right move, and this alone will give a sense of belongings to every sector of the nations. And these are things that we need to strengthen our democracy to bring about the peace we clamor for. Um, it is going to be very very difficult coup to happen in this country. First of all, number one, everybody is wise now who will will draw, will withdraw us back instead of making us to become forward. I think we understand. So democ democracy in this country is the best action, especially the American system we are following is the best. So coup will never happen in this country. We are the giant of Africa. We know what we are doing. All is a mere saying, it's a speculation. Uh, it's not going to be a coup. 
sir. The architecture and the security they selected in this country is in a proper perfect. You see, it's the first time now. You see, Ibo man has already got a chief of naval staff. It's a, it's a mix. Even in this Kaduna South, they are crying the, the chief of joint staff. So, 